You're watching 41 Action News. I'm Bryant Madrick. Here are your top stories for Sunday, March 8th. The first case of COVID-19, also known as coronavirus, has been confirmed in Johnson County, Kansas, and in St. Louis County on the Missouri side. While these are the first cases for Missouri and Kansas, your risk of contracting COVID-19 is still extremely low. We know the patient is a woman from Johnson County, and we know that she's under 50 years old and that she's already in isolation. On the Missouri side, we know the patient is a woman in her 20s who recently traveled to Italy. Officials are reminding the public that the risk is still very low, but you should still wash your hands to protect yourself. With March Madness just two weeks away, the NCAA is looking at how coronavirus could affect the competition. According to the Wall Street Journal, they say they are not considering canceling or postponing the event. They say in the worst case scenario, they'll play the games behind closed doors, which means banning fans from attending the games and screening players for illnesses before they compete. The Big 12 tournament will be in Kansas City in just a few days. We have contacted the conference to see what precautions they're taking. When they respond, we'll let you know. Your forecast is next. Thanks, Brian. Today, 70 degrees, the first time since October 18th, and it'll be very windy with south 20 to 35, gusting 40 to 50 miles per hour. Mostly sunny, still a fire danger until tonight when the rain moves in around midnight. It could be heavy at times, windy and mild, 54 for the low. 60 degrees tomorrow, periods of rain and a few thunderstorms ending during the afternoon and evening as temperatures drop into the 40s. And then Tuesday, a much nicer day with highs in the 50s, but some much needed rain. A widespread quarter to one inch of rain is likely. You can get your news and weather anytime on KSHB.com.